At first, I wasn't really thinking about it, but when I, you know, was walking to the court, and it was a pretty long walk, I'd say actually about five minutes, I was just really focused on my match and focused on my opponent, Monfils, who was 20 in the world, and uh, I wasn't really, ex I know, I knew I was playing on grandstand, but I wasn't really expecting the crowd or the electricity. I really ha didn't have a, a, good grasp on, a good grasp on it because, honestly, I wasn't thinking about it. And then, you know, walking out and then and hearing people cheering my name and all that was something truly special and, you know, it made me a little bit nervous at first. But after a while, I got used to it and it was something that was really special and cool to experience. Personally, I think for every American tennis player, the U.S. Open is uh, a dream to play. You know, I went to the event since I was maybe 10, 12 years old, and I've been there every year since. So seven, so for seven straight years, I came. In the past three years, I've played in it. When I was 15, I played in the juniors. 16, I played in the qualifying of the men's and the juniors. And this year, I played in the main draw of the men's and also of the juniors. So uh, each year, it's just gotten better and better, and hopefully I can continue to improve upon that. First of all, I think that you know my game has improved a lot this year, and it's keep it's in continuing to improve. So I felt that for me, the, my best decision for tennis uh, would be to turn pro and to pursue it professionally instead of going to college. Just because I think that if my goal is to win Grand Slam someday, I need to, you know, take tennis 100% seriously and not and not go to school. Obviously, uh, in the recent years, college has become an option for people to transition into the pros, but I felt for me, if my goal was to win slams, then, I sh then the best decision for me was to turn pro and to start uh, playing professionally now. I've been working with Taylor Dent, Jenny Dent, and Phil Dent uh, for the past year, since last November, and I've had a really great experience there. Taylor, who is an awesome guy and has taught me a real lot. You know, Phil's worked with me a lot on the serve, Jenny on the fitness, and all around they've been very supportive, supportive of me, almost like a second family. And uh, you know, I couldn't ask for more. I couldn't ask more from them, to be honest. I just go out there and play tennis. I do what I love, and you know, I love what I do. So, no matter what label you have next to my name, whether it's pro, amateur, junior, collegiate player, um, you know, bad player, good player, whatever. It's I'm just playing tennis, and I'm just doing what I really enjoy to do.